a.m. We're in Norway and I've just never felt like I needed a shower more so I'm gonna have a little flannel wash in the sink. We are halfway up a mountain pass. Unfortunately, it's still really snowy up here and the mountain pass is closed. So we have to go back down the mountain and through the longest road tunnel in the world. We are just about to enter a tunnel and it's 24.5 kilometers long. Wait, stop then. Longest tunnel! We're in the middle of the tunnel. There's 24 kilometers and we're at kilometer 12. And they put up these fun lights just to, I guess, to help you not get distracted on the road, but also to tell you that you're halfway. It's a bit smelly in here, quite warm. Probably really bad to breathe in all the pollution, but we had to get out and just to celebrate the fact that we're halfway and we're in a tunnel, the world's longest tunnel. This looks like quite a good shop. I'm thinking about getting some hiking boots because I've sent some money for my birthday. Um, and I have heard that the sporting stuff in no Norway isn't actually as expensive as you might think, but um, I'm not convinced, so we'll find out. It was pretty expensive still. Um, I mean, camping equipment's expensive at home as well. It's still really expensive. Um, I think we're just going to hold off for now. So this is our first experience of a Norwegian supermarket. We're going to check out the prices. We just need some bread for lunch. No biggie. Yeah, we're still surviving on our German rations. Yeah, we're still surviving on that 100 euro shot we bought back in Germany. Still going strong, lots of tins left, but we're running out of fresh stuff. Almost four euros for a loaf of bread. We need our cheese slice, we're in Norway now. <laughs> four euros for a can of baked beans. So I've noticed hummus was about two pounds. They have a massive, they have lots of vegan cheese, which is good. The reason those baked beans were so expensive is because they were Heinz, so they were employed for the UK. Their own brand is much different. How much? Uh, 11. So there's some white vegan cheese. But I mean, that's like six pounds. The whole shop came to 242 krona, which is about like 21, 22 pounds. Um, I mean, we did buy like some fake cheese and some fake salami, so. And a cheese slice. So my first time in a secondhand shop in Norway, I've just found these New Balance for Tom, 40 krona, about three pound 50. And this nice flask for 15 krona. Do, do, do. There's a little present, little birthday present from me. <laughs> Just hide you over till the other one arrives. Straight away, another tunnel. 2.5k. Here we are, the cute little petrol station, right with the backdrop of amazing mountains. Um, 
This 22 kroner, so not too bad. I'll get, I'll get half a tank. So Lars told us some advice. <laughs> Before you go into the tunnel, in the bright, shut your eyes for about two seconds. So when you come into the tunnel, you're supposed to not be such an adjustment to the dark, but we, we're not sure if it's very safe advice. We've selected somewhere to stay the night, but we're so hungry, we selected a little picnic spot on the way. Um, but, and it was about a 30 minute drive, but on the way we just came into a lot of traffic um, and everyone was waiting with their doors open, people out of their cars. And we thought we're not chancing this we're so hungry so we just passed a really nice picnic spot so we actually did a little cheeky yui in the traffic jam and we're heading back to this picnic spot that we saw so this is just your average picnic spot in norway surrounded by mountains waterfalls and fjord definitely glad we came back here rather than sitting in traffic oh looks so good pretty like on the main road uh, we've literally just pulled straight off it but it is so beautiful here and I think this road would be pretty quiet at night so this looks like a nice park up yeah um I think we might just have a pretty chilled out chill day from now on I mean it's 4 30 we've done quite yeah. a... we've got a bit of work to do before our next video goes live and yeah. then just um, and just like plan a little bit and, yeah, and we like, haven't had, had any downtime really yeah we haven't had any downtime we've just been with people pretty much since we've been in norway so it'd be nice just to like have a bit of time just to plan and like just like tidy up and do some like housekeeping stuff really is we can't go in there no, it's not. what do you mean it's freezing oh come on now Lisa. Wow, wow, I'm really impressed. <sighs> Snowy mountains there, beautiful clear river there. Well done. Oh. I mean, that's cold. But it's, it's so clear. <laughs> you look stupid. Your glasses are stupid. You up. don't look like anything. <laughs> oh, this is so beautiful. Look where we are, Tom. Look at that. It's funny in Norway because it doesn't get dark till midnight. If you want to go to bed at 10, it's bright outside. So good job we got these blackout curtains. And that is my cue to see you in the morning. I don't want to, I'll be honest. I really don't want I to. I don't want to more. 